What else are we doing wrong? Super slow eccentrics or like really controlling the eccentric. Based on some of the literature where the eccentric part of a lift seemed to be slightly more important than the concentric, it made sense as an educated bet to, hey, spend a couple more seconds controlling the eccentric, and in some cases even longer than that. What we're seeing from the literature now is one, that the eccentric may not be more hypertro hypertrophy than the concentric, or at least not by much. And when it comes to lifting tempo, as long as you're not yoloing it, like letting the weight free fall. Controlling it. Some Something, yeah, having some resistance, not letting gravity do all the work, um, you're totally fine. Like as long as total repetition duration is somewhere in the two to eight seconds mark and you're working close to failure, that seems to be the most important thing, which doesn't mean that you shouldn't go super slow uh, for some cases, either for the concentric or the eccentric, but rather to view it as a general sort of preference versus a strict rule that, oh, if I'm not really controlling the eccentric, I'm losing potential gains.